Welcome back to my channel guys. In today's video, I have a huge bag. Wait a second. I have a huge bag of hand-me-downs that we're gonna try on today. Also, um, I'm wearing all blue. It wasn't intentional. I put on these shorts and then I put on this shirt and I was like, wow, I'm wearing all blue now. But it's okay because soon we'll be changing out of this outfit and into some gorgeous clothing. I haven't even touched this bag yet. I have no idea what's inside, but I'm excited for it. So let's get into it. I did a video like this a while ago. Honestly, I think it was probably over a year ago. I will leave that video linked in the description so you guys can go watch that after you're finished watching this one if you do enjoy watching this one. But in that video, I also tried on some other hand-me-downs and you guys seem to really like that one. So I'm excited to do it again for you guys. First outfit, this isn't really an outfit, it's just a vest. I have never owned anything like this before. So honestly, I have no idea if I would even wear this. It's kind of big, I feel like. Okay, let me, yeah, it's definitely big. I feel like it's like too big though. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like I would never ever wear this. But at the same time, I feel like it's kind of like stylish in a way. And I feel like I could definitely wear this to hip hop or something and be like dancing in it and stuff. But at the same time, like, is it really worth it? I'm going to say no to this one. I like the idea of it but I am probably never going to wear it and it doesn't fit me very good either. So this is going in the no pile. <laughs> oh yeah. I have a problem with sweatshirts. Like I hoard my sweatshirts. It's very bad. I have like 20 sweatshirts. It's very not good for me. Sorry, there's literally no way that I'm giving this up. This is a yes, 100%. It's cute and it's soft and I know for a fact that I will wear this. And it's North Face, like what the heck? Yes. This is literally the best day of my life. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. This is making me kind of excited for fall, but like then after fall is winter and like we're not about that. So, but yeah, this is cute and comfy and I will be keeping this. There's so many jackets, guys. I think this might be the last one. There might be like one more, but oh my gosh, now I'm really wearing all blue. I wish you could feel these. What the heck? They're so soft. <gasps> and it's North Face. I am keeping this. I'm keeping this. I'm keeping this. Sorry. I'm a little excited and happy. You can never go wrong with another sweatshirt. This one's kind of cute. Okay, it's comfortable, it fits, it's cute. Um, so there's no reason why I should say no to this. <gasps> Wait a second. Does this look kind of cute? I don't know. I feel like if I were to keep this vest, it would have to be better, you know? I'm still going to say no to the vest. I don't know, I feel like it's also an awkward length. Like it's really long but I'm saying yes to the sweatshirt. I'm saying yes to the dress. Now we are getting into clothing. This is super cute, right? I love this up here and it's kind of just like a chill casual shirt, but at the same time, it looks like a little bit dressy. Um, I don't, I've never, not never, that's a lie. I don't really wear this color that much but I mean, I feel like it's a good fall shirt. I usually also don't wear shirts that don't have long sleeves because I get cold. This shirt with like a pair of jeans would literally be perfect. So I'm keeping this. Okay, this is the next shirt. And I feel like it doesn't fit me right. And I feel like I would like never wear this. Like this is not something that I picture myself wearing. Yeah, I'm gonna say no for this one. Honestly, when I pulled this out of the bag, I got like really, really excited. But then I put it on because I always see these shirts like on girls and I'm like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. 
but I feel like it doesn't look good on me. And therefore, if I don't feel like I look good in a piece of clothing, then I'm probably going to shove it to the back of my closet and never wear it. Also, stripes and like this pattern. Yellow, I'm not a huge fan of yellow. Yellow is not my favorite color. It's probably one of my least favorite colors. I have a couple yellow pieces of clothing, but yeah, I just, it, okay. Okay, kind of the same thing with this one. Like when I pulled it out of the bag, I was like, oh my gosh, I love this shirt because I love this style like of shirts, but I'm not a big fan of the pattern. Like I have nothing against like flowers or anything. I don't know. I think it's cute. I feel like I would just like never wear it, you know? I feel like it doesn't flatter me well. I think that's what I'm trying to say. This one is also going to be in the no pile. Okay, this shirt on the other hand is super, super cute. Like I love this one. Okay, the sleeves, first of all, that is such a clever design and like how they like poof out. I really like this one. This one is definitely a keeper. I think it's so funny. I was just thinking while I was putting that shirt in the no pile, I was like, it's so funny how I'm saying no to all of the like girly shirts, but then when it comes to like sweatshirts and jackets, I'm like, okay. Yes, I really like this one. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like when you're just like standing like this, it's not as like cool, but then when you like bring it out and you see like the sleeves, it's like really cool. This is the next one and I definitely think I am going to keep this not just because it's cute. At first when I like looked at this, I was like, oh my gosh, this is going to be tight to my skin and my belly's gonna be showing and I'm not gonna like that very much. But I mean, it covers everything pretty well. Like maybe a little bit of my belly button, but it covers everything pretty well. It's not too tight. And I can also wear this to dance since it's like black and kind of like form fitting. So I definitely really like this one. Okay, here's the next one. This is just a t-shirt. The design on the back is very, very cool. And you guys know if you have watched my decluttering videos and videos like about fashion and stuff that I am a sucker for t-shirts. I have a whole drawer of t-shirts and I can't seem to get rid of them. So I am going to be keeping this one just because you can always use another t-shirt to like sleep in or whatever. And if I end up never wearing this shirt, then later down the road, I can end up giving it to like Goodwill or something. But for now, I will wear it. It could turn out to be one of my most worn t-shirts. Who knows? I literally love trying on clothes, like, and especially hand-me-downs, because one, they're free. Two, you know that it's a good thing because like someone's giving you their clothes, you know? I don't think that made any sense what I just said. It's just fun to like try on other people's clothes. This is the next shirt. It is very girly and very cute. The only thing that I think is weird about this shirt is that it doesn't button all the way down. So like it just like separates right here. Actually, the buttons just like come undone, which is, I don't know. I might have to like sew this shut or like pin it shut or something. Cause I feel like I could just be like, oh, hey, and then like everything just be like out. And I know that I would hate that. Um, my boobs do not fill this shirt. Um, it's definitely a little big in the chest. I feel like if it looked like this, if it was like more form fitting, it would be cuter. But since it's like loose, I don't know. Decisions. I'm going to say no for this one just because I don't like the fact that my stomach is out and it's a little big and I just feel like someone else can probably fit into it better than I can. This is the next shirt and it is super duper cute, but I know right off the bat that I do not wear as many tank tops as I used to. So I know for a fact that this is going to be one of the shirts that will sit in my closet and I will never wear it. Um, one, because sometimes I just don't feel like shaving and then I will have to wear like a long sleeve or a t-shirt and <laughs> that's just the truth if I'm going to be honest with you. Shirts like this that have like words and like designs, I like don't wear as many of these anymore 
as like t-shirts or like dressier shirts like the couple that we just saw so this one is a no for me same thing for this one this one's pretty cool because i think she definitely cut out like the sides of it which is definitely really unique um but again i will never wear this this is the next one and i do love the style of this shirt but this one is kind of uncomfortable and I'm not sure how I feel about the pattern. It's a little busy in my opinion. It's just like not really my style. I feel like it does look good on me though. I don't know. I feel like it definitely is cute. But I don't know. It is a little itchy. I don't know. When I have it on, I'm like, wow, that's really cute. But then at the same time, I know I'll look at this in my closet and be like, no, I'm not wearing that. And then never wear it. So I'm kind of on two sides with this one. I'm going to change my shorts just so I can see like the full effect. I don't know, I kind of like it. I feel like this is something that you would wear to like a fair or something, like a carnival maybe. I don't know, I like it so I'm gonna keep it. This shirt is so cool. Guys, this design, this shirt still has a tag on it. It says it was $35. Yeah, this shirt is really nice and it's very colorful and fun. And I love that, so this one I'm definitely keeping. This is the next one, and obviously I love this. I love these type of shirts. You can definitely see a trend with like my clothing choices. And yeah, I love this shirt. I have many shirts that are similar to this one, and I will most likely wear this a lot of the time. It's just like so like hippie style, and that's like so me. The way hippies dressed is kind of how I like to dress. What's up? We gotta get Swifty. We gotta get Swifty in here. Yeah. I'm literally the weirdest human being on this planet. Like, what? Like, why do I feel the need to do that? Obviously, I'm keeping this one. This is the next one. This is a cardigan. If it was a different color, I would probably love it even more. Um, I don't really know what I would wear under this, but it is comfortable and it's cute, so I am going to give it a chance. If I don't end up wearing it, then I'll give it to someone else. But for now, I really like it. Whew. We're on to jeans now. These jeans, I'm not going to lie, I struggled to get them on a little bit, which means that they're too small and they're going in the no pile also. I don't know if you can see, this is the no pile. It has six things in it. And then that is the yes pile. Also, she had a bunch of these in the bag, which is amazing because I remember using these all the time as a kid, but I will not be using these now. <laughs> these jeans are really pushing on my stomach, which means that probably none of these are going to fit. Okay, I know for a fact that I was not going to be able to get into those jeans and I know for a fact that they were not stretchy on the tag it says that they were stretchy I know that they were not stretchy because they could not get over my hips and that's a problem they were size one jeans which I'm like a four to six in jeans so that's definitely not going to work for me. So I just didn't try on the other pairs of jeans because they're not going to fit me. I'm honestly a little tired, I'm gonna be honest. Trying on clothes is fun, but it's also tiring. I am very grateful that I got to try on these clothes and I'm grateful that someone gave them to me because now I have more clothes and I don't have to waste any money. Thank you guys so much for watching and come along with me while I tried on a bunch of clothes. I hope that you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next video.